the bell of hope tolls for the victims of 9-11. The names of the dead were read out during a service at the former site of the World Trade Center, attended by police and relatives. Andrew Anthony Abate. Presidential candidates Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump put their differences aside to make an appearance and pay their respects. New York fell silent at the exact moment the first plane struck the North Tower in 2001. The ceremony paused for six moments of silence in total, four to mark the exact times the planes were crashed, and two for when the Twin Towers crumbled. The Pentagon, home to the US Defense Department, was also targeted in the coordinated terror attacks. Speaking at a ceremony there, President Barack Obama urged the country to stay true to the spirit of 9-11. It is so important today that we reaffirm our character as a nation. For we know that our diversity, our patchwork heritage is not a weakness. It is still and always will be one of our greatest strengths. Almost 3,000 people were killed on September 11th. Nearly 75,000 others were left with mental and physical illnesses as a result of the attacks.